All right. Uh, celebrity sighting over the weekend for me. Awkward moment in the celebrity sighting for me. And uh, if you uh, don't get it, then you drop out of the contest and there's a prize at the end of the contest. And I don't know what the prize is, but you don't get it. So the first round, no hints. All right. Then a slight hint. And then uh, we'll see if somebody is able to guess the celebrity sighting for me over the weekend in New York City. Todd, I'll start with you. Joe Gorga, Real Housewife of New Jersey. Okay. I like that. Now, you can pass and wait for the hint second round, but then you run the risk of somebody getting that celebrity sighting. Seat no counter. Keith Richards. Keith Richards, no. Marvin? Bobby Flay. Bobby Flay. <laughs> Good call. <laughs> Answer is no. Polly. Since I'm last, Dan, I will pass and wait for the hint. Okay. Oh, that since is I, soft. Since I'm the only guy who could win this now. <laughs> That's true. Um, let's see. Let me give you a hint. Andre Agassi. Andre. No. <laughs> no. Uh, this is an actor. Oh. Person's an actor. Obviously not an Oscar nominee. No. No. Maybe they're salty about that. I don't know if the actor has been in a lot of movies. Oh, I was going to say Ethan Hawke. Ethan Hawke would have been a good call. Chris Tucker. Chris Tucker. Christopher that... Merloni. Bloop, 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 bloop. No <laughs> wow. Let's go. Yes. I'm sitting with my daughters, <laughs> and my youngest daughter is always spotting celebrities. Always. The last time we went to this restaurant, she goes, uh... Dad, Courtney Love is staring right back at me. I said, well, then don't stare at her. Well, she's staring at me. And I go, are you sure it's Courtney Love? And I look over and I go, I'll be damned. That Courtney Love is right there staring at my daughter. Like, what are you doing staring at me? And then my daughter was going to have a stare down with Courtney Love. Did anything else happen with Courtney Love? No. That was it. Now, Law & Order, you know, big time TV show. Elliot Stabler, Detective Stabler. And my uh, daughter goes, uh, Dad, Chris Maloney is uh, right over your shoulder. And I thought he was like right over my shoulder. And I said, uh, what's the show? And then my oldest daughter goes, oh, Law and Order. And I go, okay, all right. So now they're talking about Law and Order and all the great episodes and what they love about the show. Now, Dad, being a so-called celebrity, now... I have to go over at the end of the meal, wait for him to be done with his meal. He was with a group of people. So then I can go over and do the celebrity, saying hello to a celebrity. And I walked over and I went, um, hi, Chris, I'm Dan Patrick, sportscaster. He goes, okay. And then I went, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah, it was bad. It was bad. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> And, and, and I had my daughters there with me, and I think they're thinking, well, this guy obviously knows our dad. And then they realized that he didn't, and then they tried to clean up the mess, you know, the spill in aisle six. Oh, and then my wow. daughter goes, and then my, one of my daughters goes, um, I never watch your show. It makes me too nervous. And I go, that's not a good line to have. <laughs> my other daughter goes, I watch. And that's all she said. And then my oldest daughter started reciting uh, episodes there. And then I finally, oh. I said, uh, do, you, do you live in the, nearby? And he told me what street he lived on. <laughs> he didn't ask where I lived. And I go, oh, I, I live close by too. And then there's pause. <laughs> <laughs> and I can feel my wife tugging on my shirt like, uh. let's get out of here. <laughs> and it was bad. Din -din. It was, it was Din -din. <laughs> yes, exactly. I could hear the... The Law and Order music in my head going, oh, no. Law and Awkward. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bloop, bloop. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, I'm the sports guy. Okay.